Children are well, dying. <laughs> yes, that is the case. Bitten by some creature, and we need someone with good combat training to help him. Someone who so yes, welcome everyone. We are the Grin Brothers, and we're here to um see a dead child or dying child. But George, you've already explained why okay. you. So I'll go. Thank you. One of my favorite things about this quest line is if you actually um do it properly, which is to, you know, save the child. Yeah. McCready doesn't like you. No, because he needs that he could do that very thing. Well he doesn't even know if it's gonna work. He just wants it. Not now, And you stranger will have to wait your turn. No, like no, you could I remember Kiris fighting Bobby before. Okay. Hopefully she'll find some. But these aren't ordinary mole rats. Hmm. Who knows what kind of diseases they're carrying. Is it as such a thing as an ordinary mole rat? Bobby doesn't look like he's got a healthy body type. No. I found something that might help us. Bobby! Hold on, Priscilla. What is it, Bobby? Well, you know that door Austin found? He found it because I'm... I keep my private things in there. He saw me get them. You mean your chems? Get to the point, Bobby. What did you find in that place? Like a hole, it's the vault in there, half ruined. Oh, in. there was this terminal there, so I started poking around. There, there were some notes and stuff about using mole rats to grow viruses. But they oh, they wait, so he started poking around after the kid got bit, or has he just been doing that in his spare uh, time? I think beforehand, oh. but like, of course, because there might be a cure for whatever Austin got from that mole rat because he's a druggie, yeah. No one trusts him with it, or yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> Alright, wasn't talking to you, man. <coughs> uh, sure. Uh, glad to help? We already know what's going on. Yeah, I mean, we kind of eavesdropped here. There is a chance that somewhere in there is a cure for Austin. If you find it. I know a cure for Austin. It's in the form of a baseball bat. If you want, I can take the buzzsaws off. <laughs> But that does less damage, so it'll be less quick and painful. Shh. They don't need to know that. Yeah, no, no, Bobby doesn't look healthy. He I... takes drugs, so of course this boy's either going to be in tip-top shape. I mean, that's true, but like... Bobby doesn't help, he sits in the reactor room. Can't imagine that's good for you. Oh, I think this is where he usually is. I was about to say, what, no one goes to this place? Well, I Feels think like it's a pretty important room to not go to. <laughs> Can you... <laughs> is that is that how everyone has to open that door? <laughs> yeah. I, cool. He's broken. Yeah. <laughs> no, it turns out this wasn't supposed to be a secret vault. It's just a glitch. More glitches upon the glitches. The cat is here. Yeah. <laughs> The cat is the true mastermind, yet again. So I think you can actually get through this place. If you don't take any damage, I don't think you get the disease. Wait, you can get the disease as well? Yeah, it does something like minus 10 health. Huh. Yeah, it's a pretty terrible disease. So how's the kid dying from a mere minus 10 health? He probably only has 10 health. Ah, kid needs to grind. Oh, well, he's a kid. Wait. No, it's still probably <coughs> what do you need to do, Piccolo? Way. Steal the kid to train him up. Oh gosh, why has my RAM gone up so high? I don't know. Uh, is anything going to spawn? Hmm. Laptop's suddenly heated up all of a sudden. It's probably because it's illegal. It was like, <laughs> wait, we're illegal. Stop. And the disc spiked just then. Not sure why. I guess because that update tried to happen and I cancelled it because my again it's illegal. Yeah. <laughs> um. <clears throat> so this is the gimmick of vault eighty. What are we in? Eighty one. Eighty one. Um. Mole rat viruses. They wanted to. They created a bunch of diseases. Yep. Um. Pause if you really want to read. But basically, they created a bunch of diseases, and they're like, "We'll make humans immune to any and every disease that could possibly come about." 
Which is, you know, a good moral idea. Um, of course, this is vault Ah, lasers! So they never go That's wrong. the scariest moral I've ever seen! <laughs> <laughs> so, we make, uh, so to make sure that uh, people are immune to lasers, we've managed to make this mole rat shoot lasers. I don't think we've quite uh, got the process of this down right. Oh, and a protection. I don't remember it being this dangerous in here. I do. I mean, Kyrus did this earlier on and he had a fairly easy time of it all. I can teleport through walls, sucker. What are you going to do about that? I'd be very sad if the if the conqueror of the Commonwealth gets killed in a random vault from Mograt viruses. Which admittedly come through the form of lasers here, but... It would be pretty entertaining, though. Bobby got bit because of me by the laser-firing mole rat. Bobby... <clears throat> Is sorry, not Bobby. Not uh, the child. Austin. Austin. I was trying to say, as in, like Bobby was the one referring to it, and then I'm skipping a few lines. <laughs> yeah, I, <know. laughs> I, I, I get you. Uh, I've done it enough times. I just don't. We have to make sure the audience understand our broken sense <laughs> of jokes. Um. Um, so yeah, basically, yeah, like yeah, it was a nice idea, but also they were just going to infect a bunch of people with highly dangerous diseases that probably would kill them. Of course, it's Voltec. Yeah, a a sweet innocent Voltec that did nothing wrong. What? what does that say? Maint only. Oh, maintenance only. No, no. maint. <laughs> yeah, you know, good boy main. Only he's <laughs> around in there. What does he he's do? He's the one we plan on not infecting with the viruses. <laughs> we need somewhere for him to hide away as we all die. I fortunately have not been attacked by a mole rat because they've just. I think that's been... one just right ahead. No, that's a table. Hand the machine gun. Yeah. Dear course these mole rats are getting sophisticated down here. <laughs> <laughs> so our um, a virus didn't go quite as planned. He didn't get really to kill us. So just, we're, the, we're the mutant mole rats who sit down here. You just gave us a bunch of guns. <laughs> That's not even a disease. We were gonna give a gun to gain intelligence. Who'd have thought? Yeah, I'm pretty sure mole rats are supposed to spawn. <laughs> <laughs> Pure. Well, entry denied. Like the zero. I relate to that. One. So, so it can't be deal. Can't be deny. <sighs> can't be higher. Can't be IGN. Uh, Sorry, sign. Dark I, or down, then? I, I only saw dark the or down. Dark. Dark or down. Um... They have to be in the right order, don't they? Oh no, it can't be dark. Down then. It's down. Yeah, it can't be dark because of the uh... Likeness zero? What? Now it's time for witchcraft. But the D E A. Okay. Seed. Zero. Uh, warn. Two. Um. Um. Warm. Wait, no, it can't be warm. Well, it can uh, be warm. It can be warm. Nice. It is yeah, we go. I don't know why I just <coughs> this. Um. Protecting from the mole rats. Where the hell are they? Are you friend or foe? Your friend. I kind yeah, of want you to die because you've got loot on you. But we've got enough loot as it is. And if need be, we can just try to get more bottle caps out of people who want to take our blood. Um, it means we've got backup for the Morites with machine guns. <laughs> Bobby's dying of a virus. These are bullets. <laughs> I mean, they'll probably kill him a bit quicker. <laughs> Sorry, not Bobby. Austin again. What the... Yeah, you really want Bobby dead for some reason. <laughs> oh, no, I, don't, I just think I don't like the name Austin. Ah, this looks like a mole rat spawn. Are there any names you dislike? Like, specifically dislike... Oh, a mole wow. rat! Um, okay. I killed it! You see that, Dave? 
Like, uh, for instance, uh, maybe it's because I was bullied when I was at school. But Jamie. I cannot stand the name Jamie. Just sounds like they're eating. Are they going to be able to burrow up here? They shouldn't. Dogmeat, you alright? Yeah, Dogmeat's fine. I feel like they've just left. <laughs> Over there, they're inside the container. They buried it underneath and they got glitched into it. I mean, there's that stim pack you can grab in between, in the middle there. Of those two containers. Hold on a second, actually. I... They didn't hit me. No, it was from the laser gun. That's true. I did get hit by a laser. Cool. Well, I'm glad you just catch a disease by living. Um, you do that, buddy. <clears throat> so let's see here. Um, it's you know I had planned to talk about it earlier. Um, because when it was more relevant, I'm now subscribed to him, but. I've um, been watching a YouTube channel called uh, Geek Critique. Oh, okay. Oh, gosh. And uh, a partially invisible mole rat. Oh, I was about to say a legendary one? No, it's, a, it's your project one. Buddy, can you... I can't hit him for some reason. He's phasing in and out of existence. Yeah! Uh, no, that was the wrong one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dear gosh, this place is insane! <laughs> when in doubt, baseball bats. <laughs> um, God, yeah, I've been watching a YouTube channel called The Geek, uh, the Geek Critique. Uh, um, I've heard of that. Yes, um, but the main area I've been watching it is I've been watching and drawing up. Because Game Explain, the, the thing is, uh, with the uh, what I've been doing is that when I wash up, I like to have a video playing in the background because. Wait, where are they talking from? For worse. Okay. Um. Uh, you know, because uh, Raffi hasn't been around to help me to do the drying up, I've had no one to talk to as I wash up, so I like listening to having a video playing on in the background. And before then, I was using the Game Explain videos. Uh, stuff like um, their Super Smash Bros. discussions, uh, or Derek's Pokemon and Paper Mario playthroughs. Mm. But he hasn't done his Pokemon stream in ages, thanks to well, Smash Bros. and Castlevania, so once again, I can be angry about Smash Bros. and its third party character inclusions for another reason. Um, Hull is probably the only person in here I'd happily kill. The, um... <coughs> what was I? Yeah, so, but currently, he hasn't done the Pokemon uh, uh, live stream since, the Pokemon Platinum live stream since, um, Simon, pretty much Simon, around the time Simon Belmont got revealed in Smash Bros, because he's been doing a Castlevania retrospective. Okay. So playing through all the games, which is taking God there forever. Uh, and it's really annoying because I've been I enjoyed the Pokemon Platinum a lot, and the only Castlevania game play a live stream of his I want to check out is the his playthrough of Castlevania 64. But like that was weird, like the he missed out like the first 10, 15 minutes for some reason on his recording. Huh. Um. Well, we definitely have the Mobile Disease now. We had it before. Um. Somehow. From laser beams. Um. <clears throat> And his current, uh, the current part I got to his Paper Mario playthrough is him playing Super Paper Mario. It is a lot harder to have Super Paper Mario playing in the background than it is the other Paper Mario games yeah. because, you know, the other ones are turn-based. So it's easy to kind of look away for a while. Super Paper Mario being more action in the game. Yeah. <laughs> 
He now has minus four health. Oh, we got minus ten health by walking. Frankly, his there. stats suck. I request restarting his character. I've got the I've got the spreadsheet here. <laughs> Get out your dice. We'll re-roll him. <laughs> We will build him stronger as long as the dice is roll such. Oh. Okay, we roll the a dice. And he's, okay, what is he? Well, he's a barbarian who's maxed in charisma. We roll his! <laughs> Ow. <clears throat> this is kind of satisfying, really, wasn't it? Um. God, this weapon's fun. Not necessarily <coughs> great. I feel like we could use far more powerful No, nah, but it's more fun this way. But... And besides, we, we conquered the way... In anyway. no! And this one doesn't count as stealing. It doesn't. But yes, um... So, you know, I wanted a more talk-based thing. You know, more dialogue-only sort of video to have playing in the background. That's when I stumbled... Again, upon the Geek Critique, because I've actually watched one video of his before, which was I watched his Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze video a long time ago. Um, so I decided, to, and he did an entire coverage of the Donkey Kong series, and he's also done so of Metroid, and he's been doing so of Sonic. So I've been having them play in the background. I've actually caught up into pretty much uh, on all three of his main series he does. He also has some more generic um, video series, and he's also got a really short one on Power Ranger video games for some reason, which I've also watched, but... So at the moment I've caught up, but because I enjoyed them a lot, and they're great for listening to as I do, do the washing up, um, yeah, I've uh, subscribed to his channel. Fair enough. <clears throat> um... I'm subscribed to channels which I haven't uploaded for years. <laughs> oh, that's we that's freaky. What? This morning... Open up my laptop. Jontron's updated again. Oh yeah, Jontron's uploaded. That's not who I meant by people that haven't uploaded in years. But... I know, but it feels that way whenever it's Jontron. No, I've had a few people like that. A few people who I've watched. I mean, I've, I usually go through and sort out my channels after every now and again. Why? Well, so I unsubscribe from a few people. But... I've remained subscribed out of respect because uh, they, they left YouTube. Mm. So it's like, yeah, they're not going to upload, but respect to the channels, you know. Because it's uh, like Mind Flame oh. and Oxhorn. Oh, you're already dead. A lot of the older channels I used to subscribe to were all AMV channels, though. Yeah. I miss the days of good AMVs. Um, yeah. Only occasionally. I did come across a really good Hajime no Epo one recently, which I think had like which had like Silver's theme from Sonic from Sonic 2006 music to it, but it was actually a really well done video. Huh. Because, like, you know, the opening part, there was, like, a good sort of... I think it was, like, 2006 of music. Uh, the opening part was, um... Um... Why is that dog glowing? Uh, it's because he's been, like, bitten or something. I don't know. He's probably got a disease. Mm. We found the cure for the kid! Give him this vodka! I mean, I'll take it. Um, I do, Kenneth. That's all we need to know. <laughs> uh, Where is everyone? This is like a lot of reading. That is just uh, so. Click on everything once, and it should uh, allow people to pause and see. Um. I'm pretty sure this is um, just explaining how the... But like, there's this, like a slow-paced opening sort of thing. So they did in this AMV video, they had to like, have it be the each of the sort of boxes walking up to the ring sort of thing. Hmm. So, you know, that, you know it's, it's really well paced like that. Um, it doesn't go overboard with the animation sort of, eff with the special effects or anything. It's just mostly really well cut together clips from the different fights. Yeah. Um... Which sometimes works better, because sometimes people overdo it with the visual effects. Oh, on the note of, like, AMVs, um, and <laughs> anime in general, I've been watching a lot of Black Clover. Yeah. Um, and it's just, it's really good. I enjoy it a lot. 
Mm. I came in at the worst time, though. Friends are what define you! Oh. Screw you, little girl. Yeah. I'm just gonna um, continue my lonely existence. But, um... Mm. There was a... Oh, yeah. So... Oh. I mean, it uses really good use of colour with the whole, like, black and white thing every now and again. Yeah. I just did that, though. Oh, I have to... There we go. There we go. Um, an opening number, I think it's four? Oh, we're here. Opening number... Oh, wait, you mean Black Rover? Or was that opening number three? That's opening number three. Ah. Loved opening number three. Like the, the music on that is insanely good. Hold on. Alright, I'm not going to rob these graves. Except I took a vase at that one. Don't know why it had a vase in it. That's really sweet. Yeah. Also good use of lockers. But yeah, it's not like they've got much else to, yeah. to make a coffin out of. Um, Broken. See, Thank Albert you for talking. Curie. Thank you for talking like a robot. I was going to say when you thin the episode here. Oh. And you'll wait patiently as we start the next episode. But not as patiently as Ada. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, See ya. Cheerio.